So hello everyone and welcome to our Off the Clock Library Talk podcast. When we're off the clock and we're ready to talk to you, our, I don't know, people. <laughs> people. You're our people now. Hi people. Hi people. <laughs> I wouldn't say fans or fellow community. That's the word I was there looking for. Ah, oh, hello like community. That. Hello community of YouTube. People. I was going to say, <laughs> you live in Earlville. <laughs> We do live in Arlo, that's true. Welcome. So thank you for being here today. So over our podcast journey here at the Arlo Library, we'll be covering library pastimes, upcoming programs, and random topics like that. One of our pet peeves is when we walk into a store or another library and we see all the books, Kitty Wumpus. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, you yeah. don't even know that it's a librarian's nightmare until you walk in one. Yeah. It's horrible. Yeah. You can see the librarians because we're like moving stuff. <laughs> Alphabetizing things, yeah. Oh, oh my Nina gosh. Nina and I went to an event and uh, the books oh were crazy. Oh, oh they were no. real crazy. We were just, we looked at each other and I was like, yeah. you can't do anything right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like, Don't look over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was, it, yeah. But everyone, you know, every place has their different ways of how they organize their things. It we're very particular with how we organize our things here. Yeah. We have never. to be, or we'll never find anything. Mm -hmm. I think that's it, is that other places don't care. We do. <laughs> yeah, when you're like, hey, I need that one book by this random person. With the I need cover to go on it, find it. I can't be wandering around no. looking through stuff that's toppled over. No. Yeah, I just... Nope. And I think that's what, why, like, what we do here is so beneficial like for us and our sanity <laughs> because everything is you know put in a certain way and then it's like mm -hmm. oh when that person who asks me for the blue cover with the boat on the front yeah. of it that's why i can find it uh -huh. that's why i can find it because i can put blue book cover with a boat on it and then yeah. it'll tell me exactly what it is and then, then it'll go it. and it needs to be it needs to be there yeah that's right and sometimes it's not yeah. sometimes it's not that well, sometimes it goes missing when you know Johnny comes Someone in. Someone comes in, yeah, yeah, and is like, I shall put this away myself <laughs> and it'll be grand. And I'm like, don't! <laughs> I will put everything away. Don't touch it. Yeah, I'm always yeah. like, you could just leave that there. You, you, please just leave it there. <laughs> well, there has been one time where I was putting movies away and they're all, the whole movie shelf, at least the one side, was all turned inside out. Oh, oh no. And please. I was like, um, I don't know what DVDs these are, and now I have to remove the whole shelf and turn it right back around. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, nice. like, I'm like, what happened? Who does that? <laughs> yeah. But we did have a helper come in the other day who came in and just pushed the movies in. Oh, nice. I think I know that helper. Yeah. Nice. I told that helper once before. <laughs> you don't get candy if you keep messing up my DVDs. <laughs> He stopped. <laughs> he really wanted the candy. That person stopped. <laughs> yeah. He really that was wanted funny. Candy. The little ones, the little know, ones. they don't always understand. No. I think I asked him, hey, are you messing up my DVDs? And he just looked me in the face and went, uh-huh. <laughs> and I went, no, that's not what I mean. <laughs> I mean, stop it. <laughs> but he was cute. He fixed it. And yeah. he got his candy. Nice. Yeah. But we are your librarians here at the Irvill Library District. And my name is Nina. Please welcome my fellow librarians. Please state your name. And if you had any superpower, what would it be? Oh. Oh. Go. Oh, okay. I'm Miss Miranda. Hi, Miss Miranda. Hey, Miranda. Uh, I want to teleport. Is oh, that what oh, it's called? Yeah. Go okay. from one place to another. Mm -hmm. Sure. Like in the midst of the air. <laughs> I don't know how it all works because it's not a thing. Mist too? That's yes. two powers. Yeah. I mean, I need people to see me coming. Misty you know? teleportation. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, that would be really cool. Yeah, I that agree. Cool. Like when on Star Trek, when you get to be beamed up somewhere, oh, you right. can just yeah. beam yourself. Yeah. Or um, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate, chocolate, chocolate Factory. Yeah, I mean, I kind of do. <laughs> she, just, she just, like, humors us. She's like, oh, yeah, Star Trek. <laughs> I mean, I know what beam me up means. Beam right. me up, Scotty, is that a thing? <laughs> yep. Yeah, that's a thing. It is. Yeah, like Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory where he takes that kid and, like, transports him from one place into in the, the TV. In the Wonka so. Yeah. It was, it was in the tube of chocolate, the, right? The white, the white room. Yeah, it was, like... He took, oh, a, oh, he oh, took yeah. a piece of chocolate first and like transformed Wonka Vision or something? Yeah. I forget what it's called. Yeah, so it'd be cool. I, I gotcha. <laughs> I'm thinking of you know, the kid that got shot up the pipe of chocolate. No, not him. Augustus Gloop? No, no yeah. Yeah. Augustus. 
No. That is a good movie. That's another movie that we constantly watch at my house. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. The original or the Johnny Depp version? No, the original. Yeah, the original is way better. Yeah. In my opinion. I love Johnny Depp, don't get me wrong. Yeah. I just really like the original. Yeah. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Mm -hmm. I agree. That's one of Mark's favorites. What's your superpower? I'm Paige, and I would pick, I think, Invisibility. Oh. Because then you could go spy well. on people? No. Because then when I'm scared, I could oh. really just be invisible. I really didn't <laughs> even think about that. But I could also do that. I mean, you could. I mean, I guess that's a good one. I'm actually a bunny. <laughs> <laughs> My rabbits are scared of everything. And I just want to be like, Boop, not here. Yeah, not here. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> it would be a good thing to, to be able to do. I mean, I yeah. agree. I would have to say my superpower would either be one or two things. Um, I would love super strength because I'm weak as oh. all get out. <laughs> or to be able to stretch to be taller. Oh, oh yeah. One of those funny. because I am like, so short. Stretch Armstrong. <laughs> yeah. Like the stretchy lady from The Incredibles. Oh, oh her, the mom? Yeah. yeah. Elastic girl, yeah, yeah. Elastic girl. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I want to be very cool. cool because I want to be able to reach my coffee cups at the top of my shelf. I can't reach it, and I like my coffee. <laughs> Just before we came down here, I was getting the smoke detectors off the top shelf in the office, and Brad was like, "Need some help." <laughs> And I'm just like, it's up here somewhere. <laughs> These are falling down. Yeah. You need some help over there? Uh, I forget, like, other people can access those things. <laughs> well, I can't. If it's so funny, like, so we have this, like, cabinet at my other job. And I have all my coffee cups at the top of this cabinet, oh. okay? And I have lots of cups, as you guys all know. Yeah, I love my cups. cups. Mm -hmm. So I was trying to get a cup, or a plastic cup, so I can put it under the Keurig so it can catch all my coffee and put it in the freezer to get cold. Ah. Because that's just how I do my iced coffee. Um, and I yeah. don't put it in with my ice because then it melts the ice. Exactly. Yeah. It's just yucky. I agree. It's just <laughs> yucky. <laughs> but I can't reach it because mm. I'm shorty McShore here. Mm -hmm. I had to grab a chair <laughs> to climb just up to the counter to get to my coffee cup. She does that too. <laughs> yeah, it's a thing we have to do. It's not weird for me. When she took the sign off, or er, the puzzle, she took the puzzle off the top shelf the other day. And I was like, are you kidding me? And she's like, how do you think I got it up there? And I said, a chair, Miranda. Not <laughs> people stand on chairs. No, not tall people. Yeah, I don't know that life. I don't know, it's like, I don't know what it's like to see through a crowd. Oh. I don't yeah, know. Either. I just see the back of whoever's in front of me, and I just yeah. walk in blind confidence. Oh, God. I hope I person. get there. I hold on to somebody for dear life, and yeah. I follow them. I can't see anything. Yeah. yeah. I, I, and I, I, I like go, here. oh, yeah, there's people that can see stuff. I'm the one that you're grabbing. Yeah. Because <laughs> you're like, the top of here. Through the, through yeah. the crowd. I just, I think that's why I don't know anything about directions or, like, I can never orient myself because I have just followed for my whole life because oh. I'm not tall enough to get anywhere. <laughs> well, you take care of this. I'll just get... Do well, I, do. I think you're... I think at your worst when you're downstairs in the basement because you don't know left oh, from... the directions? Like, the directions yeah. of Oh, town. I don't know. Yeah. She could be outside and looking at the thing and go, I don't know where it is. <laughs> yeah. I think the one time we were talking about that and somebody was like, so what room is what right below us? And I was very definitively like... Uh, the park, and uh, everyone was like, absolutely not. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, because you walk this way, and then you go down the stairs, and there's the park. And then someone was like, what do you see when you look out those windows? And I was like, the neighbors. <laughs> <laughs> and they were like, yeah! And I was like, no. <laughs> I can't. I have no spatial orientation either. Yeah. yeah. I do know that the park is that way, the post office is that way, mm -hmm. our neighbors are this way. I don't know And that. my truck is that way. <laughs> I would have told you the park was over there. But I also get it too, like if you've been down here for so long, it's like... I mean, I, I know now, like I know the office is above the furnace room because mm -hmm. we've talked about it enough. Yeah. So I say that. I don't see you it. You don't know it. <laughs> I just understand that that's how it is. Uh -huh. When we first moved into my house... I would continually like walk up the stairs and be surprised by what I saw out the window because I would think I was going to look in the backyard and be like, oh, that's the street. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's God. a new place, so I totally get it. Totally Hilarious. Get it. I mean, I know it's out the windows now. 
But at first, I'd walk out there and be like, oh, outside. <laughs> yeah, it's not great. I'd love to be a fly on the wall. How about that? Is that a superpower? <laughs> I do wish that sometimes. I really do. I really do. No, flies get swatted. Not if you're careful. Not if you're invisible. <laughs> yeah, I have two powers. You're and, an invisible and you fly. Can teleport tape. Teleportate. Teleportation. I was gonna say teleportation, but not even teleport. Teleport. I'm gonna go teleportate. <laughs> well, now that we've introduced ourselves, let's start today's episode. Today, Miss Miranda and Miss Paige will start. Will need to guess what song I'm reading to oh. them, or my lovely assistant Google Translate. Uh -oh. They will need to work together and figure out which song is being read to them. So, girls, are you ready? Oh boy. Um, no, absolutely not. No. I don't know many songs to begin with. Is it Mozart? Paige <laughs> listens to the songs that don't have words. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, these are very, I would say, popular for our generation. Yeah, that's, that's not going to help me. <laughs> oh, I think it will. So are you going to sing it? <laughs> I'm, I'm going, going to read it You're going to read it and we have to guess it. Oh. Yes. Because I really want you to sing it. As much as I want to. <laughs> My nasals would not be happy if I did that. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Allergies. allergies. Springtime fun. Springtime fun. I have allergies that are all seasons. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Paige had a conversation a little bit ago. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to read you one, and then next, then I will have Google Translate tell you one. Oh. I only did a few um, in the Google Translate because I thought, you know, just be fun. Okay. 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 You. <laughs> okay. Don't really want to make it tough. I just want to tell you that I've had enough. It might sound crazy, but it ain't no lie. Baby, bye, bye, bye. What? In sync. Bye. Baby, bye, 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 bye. That's uh, all I can remember, right? Yeah, I'm trying to sing the rest of the. Mm -hmm. You may hate me, but it, it ain't, ain't no lie. lie. Baby, bye, 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 bye. bye, bye. Yeah, bye. see? That was know. playing in Walmart just. The other day, like Thursday, no, Saturday, I don't know, I was there. <laughs> At a Walmart. And there was this big giant aisle, because I think they're moving stuff, mm. and uh, it was like the clearance aisle, and then like the toasters. <laughs> I don't know what they're doing over there. Playing but, the Walmart? No, it was a uh, Peru. Oh, and yeah, they got so a weird situation going on. They're always weird over there. So like this huge giant aisle, and I was walking down the clearance aisle, and this other lady was walking in with her kids, and they were playing that. <laughs> and she walks by going... Bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd be like, I'm as old as you. <laughs> but do you guys know who sing that? In sync. There you right? go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I know that. Because I'm a 90s kid. That's right. right. Okay. I'll read another one. Okay. You're dedicated. You took the time. Wasn't long till I called you mine. Yeah, yeah. Since you've been gone. And all you'd ever hear me say. Is how I picture me with you. That's all you ever hear me say. Kelly Clarkson. So moving on. Since you've been gone. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. right. Right? I see you. Yeah. <laughs> see, I can <laughs> sing. Yeah. I can I sing the song. Yeah, Sorry. that's a good one. Yeah. I'm so surprised I, you were getting these. <laughs> I got an old one. Well, if I play something from today, I'd be like, <laughs> yeah, I did not. <laughs> Even I don't. And I was like, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, two for two. I, I will play this one. Mm -hmm. Oh. Damn, I won't look. Because I recorded them. So. Uh. It's funny how some distance makes everything seem small. And the fear that once control me can't get me at all. It's time to see what I can so to test the limits and break through. No right, no wrong. No rules for me. I'm free. Oh, oh. yeah, yeah. Mm. Let it go. Frozen. That's right. Oh, I guess I've never listened to the, like, all the words. Did, 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 did I get that right? <laughs> I mean, I've seen you the movie. You haven't listened to all the words? I mean, you I... haven't listened to the whole soundtrack over and over again? I, no, not the whole soundtrack. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can change that. Yeah. <laughs> we had a whole year where we did that. <laughs> we listened to Frozen. They're going to make me oh, listen yeah. to Frozen and neat Cheetos. <laughs> Life is hard at the library. So hard. Wow. <laughs> Uh, no, I didn't know that one. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's good. So far, you guys have gotten it. She doesn't well. watch musicals. That's why. No, I don't. I mean, yeah. I've seen Frozen. I don't Frozen, consider 
<laughs> oh, it is, though. They sing in it. But yeah, they sing, <laughs> but it's the part of the <laughs> show. They sing in it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a musical, right? Where Rent's like, it? never mind. No. <laughs> well, then, like... Stop singing. Encanto, you would think of that as... That's like a musical. Encanto? I did not see it yet. You probably don't want it. Because... What did you say? <laughs> You probably don't just want it. <laughs> I was gonna say you probably don't want to. Uh, really? And then I was also thinking about saying you probably wouldn't like it. <laughs> so it came out with you don't watch it. <laughs> I was gonna go along with it, but I couldn't. I couldn't. I had to stop you. They sing. I mean, I'll probably Heads watch up. it once just to say to that say I've you've seen it. it. Yeah. It's yeah, actually I, I like it. really enjoyed the soundtrack, and I really enjoyed the movie. Makes you sad. Yeah, oh, it so does kind of, like, but in a happy way. But in a happy way. Yeah. All right. It's like heartwarming. It's not like ah, everything's awful. Yeah, because I don't want to cry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, I have to watch that one, and then I'll have to watch Frozen again. And make sure I know the lyrics to that. <laughs> <laughs> For the next podcast. Uh-huh. For the next podcast. Okay. I'm gonna read this one. Okay. If you want my future, forget my past. If you want to get with me, better make it fast. Now don't go wasting my precious time. Get your act together. We could be just fine. Spice oh, Girls. I know this. What's it called? I don't actually know. Get your act together and we'll be just fine, right? So yeah. tell you what I want. Is it something about tell me what I want? <laughs> What's it called? Spice up your life. That's another one. It yeah. is another one. That's off their second soundtrack, isn't I it? I wasn't a Spice Girls person. I can't remember. Oh, Tell me what you want. What I really want. Tell me what you want. Wanna be. Oh, oh duh. I don't know. I wouldn't have gotten there. <laughs> I, didn't really I wouldn't have got there, but now that you say it, I... It makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. I was just trying to steal stuff from the chorus. Yes. <laughs> well, and that's, like, with this game, I'm like, well, if I gave you guys all the choruses, they'd be super easy know. to uh-huh. figure out. Yeah. At least in my opinion. Yeah. Yeah, I um, agree. I was like, well, like, some things I'm just going to, like, take from this section or take yeah. from that. Yeah. Maybe they'll know it. Maybe they won't. We'll find out. I think we're doing pretty good. You I guys are good. doing pretty good. You guys have gotten one, two, three, four so far. We even yeah. got the Google one. <laughs> You did. I was very proud of you guys on that one. We'll do that in the last one. Okay. Because I think you guys will get it. Okay. Could stump us. So here's another one. You are my fire. The one desire. Believe when I say I want it that way. But we are two worlds apart. Can't meet your heart. When you say that I want it that way. Backstreet Boys. <laughs> I want it that way. Uh-huh. That's right. Now, were you guys more of an instinct fan? Oh, I was both. I, I was, they were all hot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Backstreet Boys, all the way. Uh, I was so much more a Backstreet Boys kid yeah. than I Well, they kid. came first. Oh, is that why I watched did? the documentary about the producer of both of those. So mm-hmm. did I. The yeah. Swedish people? Mm, nope. Oh, well. Oh, well, what no, it was the guy. What was that guy's name? Mm. We watched a Netflix remember, documentary called like yeah. This Is Pop. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. maybe it was the Swedish people. Yeah, that's like all from Sweden. Yeah, they went over there to practice and stuff. Yeah, but like the guy that actually made them was like a sleazeball. Oh. Oh. Like oh. that got them together. The guy. I don't the remember Jerry that. Or something. I know the one guy. He's not from Inse- um, Backstreet Boys. He's from NSYNC. Joey Fertetta or whatever his name Joey is. Joey Fatone. Fatone. He's hilarious. In any He's got a hot dog place or something. He does? He was on Impractical Jokers. Wow. Uh-huh. Uh, his hot dog place was I on. I saw him in a Hallmark movie once that oh. my friends and I were watching for fun, you know? So we were like making fun of it and all of a sudden like Joey Fatone walks in and we were like, Joey! <laughs> <We're in here." laughs> He's just like the restaurant owner, not a main character, just like pops in to be like, hey, how is the service? Like a cameo. Like everything. Cameo. I'm like, that was, that was. I mean, out of everybody yeah he's the one that's most seen other than like justin in my opinion, and lance his like, career went yeah it did. i do know aj maybe aj mclean uh, the smaller one the yeah. short the shorter one yes um he was on 
Big Brother Celebrity. Celebrity Big Brother. Oh, oh really? This past time around. Haven't watched it. I just watched the first episode and I said, oh. eh, and I turned it off. Mm. Interesting. But. Yeah, I love the know. Backstreet Boys. I had all of them. All of the albums. Oh, yeah. I had all of everybody. I posters and oh yeah, yeah. I like the Teen Bop magazine. Yep, Teen oh, Bop yeah. was my favorite. I yep. had the winter cassette of the oh. NSYNC album. Yeah, that was cassette. a good one. Merry Christmas. Yeah. That's yes, the only I one that played around and around and around all nice. the time. Nice. Yeah, because that's what I got for Christmas one year. I was like, yeah, this is amazing. Nice. It, it really was amazing. So yeah. I just flipped it back and forth <laughs> for like weeks. <laughs> that's all I listened to. Before the city told my parents they had to put a railing on the deck. <laughs> It was like a stage, and with our boom box, yeah. <laughs> my friends and I would stand on that stage, and we would dance to Backstreet Boys and Britney Spears and all that good stuff. Yeah. Do Memories. We video of this? Nope. Thank okay. goodness. Okay. Darn. That's Shoot. not a thing. I tried, guys. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Can't insert a picture here. They don't no, exist. Nope. That one does not exist. Okay. Mm. So the next one. Oh boy. <laughs> Your stare was holding, ripped jeans, skin was showing, hot night, wind was blowing. Hot night, wind was blowing, <laughs> baby, take it going, baby. <laughs> Sorry. Hey, I just Oh, oh, you. oh, Carly Rae Jepsen. Crazy. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, so call me. Call me maybe. Maybe, baby, yeah. call me maybe. <laughs> oh my God, he's like, maybe? Like, yes. <laughs> yes. She might call you. <laughs> Sorry, I got excited about no, that. I'm I'll let you got finish it. first. And because oh I was God. like, okay, I'm like, this one is. A harder one, yeah. but it was played for so <gasps> long over People that summer. People went nuts. Uh -huh. Oh my god, yeah. like that's all we heard that summer. Yeah, yeah. But forever. Yeah. It was like, yeah, mm -hmm. that was iconic for our, that period of time. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> and now I'm on camera forever singing these <laughs> wonderful, lovely songs. <laughs> Another reason we love the podcast. Yes. That's right. <laughs> okay, let's see. One, two, three, four. Okay, we have one more left. Okay. Um, I wasn't sure how many to do, and I was like, well, I don't know if any of these are going to be hard, so I just did seven. Yeah. Oh, you need your phone? I do. <clears throat> it's another Google one, yeah? A Google one. I think Google. the Google is harder because what? it's monotone and uh, like a continuous thing. Yeah, Even there's if there's no... a period, it doesn't really stop. What language did you translate it into? English. <laughs> but I mean like back into. I tried for the longest time. I was like English to any other language just to see oh. if I could get it to go back to English. Yeah. And then I pressed something and it was like, English detected. I'm like, well, thank God, that's what I want you to tell me it in. Right. I don't want it to be in Spanish. No one's going like to know it Chinese other than me. Or something. <laughs> yeah, and then back again. Yeah, um, I was just like, no one's going to get it if it's in another language. Yeah, but that's fun. Yeah. Okay. We ready? Yes. Okay. More than hope, more than faith. This is true, this is fate, and together we see it coming. <laughs> this is obviously like a Jesse McCartney song. Or no, something. it's not actually. No. Try to a musical. Oh, God, yeah. No, I definitely wouldn't have got that one. <laughs> is this uh, start of something new? No. Is it breaking free? Yes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> is it breaking free? Something new? More than hope, more than faith. That's is like true. the iconic Zac Efron. Oh, Zac Efron is very cute. Exactly. Now. <laughs> he was like a little baby, you know, when he did High School Musical. He looked so, like, babyish. Because he was a baby. I mean, yeah, yeah. I think I learned the dances to two of their songs one summer because I was nuts. <laughs> and, yeah. So we like, sang, Karen and I sang, started something new for the library's karaoke contest. You did, you did, oh. yeah. In like, I don't know, 2008. We need to make this happen again. I think it was 11. We should do 11 or 12. Karaoke oh. thing. Oh my god, you guys could be like I stars. Did. She sang too. I did. Oh my god. I have my sister. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we need to they do They sang this. an Allie and AJ song. You I did. remember. Because <laughs> <laughs> I like that song too. <laughs> Is there a video of this? No, no, Maybe. dang. There might be pictures, but I don't think we recorded it. Well, we need to record the next one. <laughs> the next library <laughs> karaoke yes. contest. Yes, that was oh my gosh, so long ago, so yeah. so long ago. But beyond the point. But she learned all the dance moves to certain songs from High School Musical. I definitely did. We also taught the children Ho Down, Throw Down. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I've heard about them. Hannah Montana's Ho Down, Throw Down. I know yeah. bits of it. I don't remember the whole thing anymore. But I do, and will retain for the rest of my life, the Footloose one. 
<laughs> that one has come in very handy at weddings. <laughs> See, you were able to do it like that summer, like after we did it, and I'm just like, nope, I don't yeah. remember it. Literally, like, not even a month later, I'm like, I don't remember it. <laughs> it came up at a wedding I was like actually playing at in the band. Yeah. And then I knew the people getting married. That's yeah. why they hired us. So they let us come to the reception. And they played this. We had been seated like the whole time the music was going. And Footloose came on and I was like, I know this! <laughs> <laughs> and like a bunch of people came up and like tried to do it with me. And I was like wow. teaching them the thing. I'm in their like photo book for like being the person on the dance floor like teaching. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> I turned around and there's like the photographers and they had like Intense photographers. Yeah. That like made a video and everything. And I was like, oh dear. Hi. <laughs> this is forever now. <laughs> I learned this at my library. <laughs> I know there was times where we were practicing like how to do certain dances for the kids that summer. Oh yeah. So we would just be here, chilling downstairs, listening to the low down, throw down. Oh yeah. Hanging out in the back office over here. Just over it. Know. Over it. We just had it on repeat and we, we would did. just keep doing it. Literally. <laughs> yeah. This is just what we did. We did. We but did. it was so funny to think about, like, now. People are like, what are you doing? Right? And we're like, we're learning things so we can teach other people okay. how to do it. We had to do research. We did. We really did <laughs> research. research. Well, we were going to also teach them how to square dance, too, but we didn't have mm. enough children at Yeah, the time. no one came. <laughs> That's too bad. You can't square dance with three kids. No. That's a triangle. <laughs> <laughs> we know that. <laughs> well, we, were all, we also changed Cotton Eye Joe. Because the beats were all... Yeah, because there was, like, one measure short of a phrase. Uh, yeah. She would know that. Mm -hmm. I was in music school at the time, and I was like, this is not correct, I shall fix it! <laughs> <laughs> so, like, there's that one, like, the part where they switch or whatever, so you have, we had to move, like, super fast. We're like, fun! Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and we were like, no! <laughs> we're gonna fix it. <laughs> all I remember was, like, the kids were like, this is really fast. We're like, yes. Suck it, it up, Buttercup. <laughs> You're real fast. <laughs> oh, my gosh. But thank you guys so much for watching this podcast. Hopefully you ladies had a fun time yeah. figuring out all of this home. I'm proud of us. I yeah, am we really did proud good. of you guys. You guys did really good. Really, really good. Did you do good? Did you do good? <laughs> that is the question. Please let us know down in the comments below here. Hmm. So thank you again so much for watching this and watching our 10 Off the Clock Library Talk Woo! podcast. I know, it's crazy. 10 months, where'd we go? <laughs> it's been a long time. We're going to have to do something fun for our year. Uh -huh. We are. Oh, she already knows. All right. Okay. Maybe. Who knows? All Maybe. right. All right. We'll have to I'm find excited. out. Mm -hmm. We'll have to find out. So we are going to rattle off our social media platforms so that you can follow us on all of our social media platforms so you know when we upload next. Like here, on YouTube, we don't have a URL because we don't have enough people to subscribe to us. So please, subscribe and like this video. We would really appreciate it to give you a URL, okay? Because we feel very silly saying this out loud. <laughs> Most of the time I mess it up, too. <laughs> and... Like Facebook, uh... Do you want to say it, Miranda, or do you think you're... Oh, I think I know it. Okay. Th today, right. I think I know it. Hey, Miranda, what is Facebook? Facebook.com slash Earlville Public Library. Yay! Got it. And Miss Paige, can you tell them about Instagram? Our handle. Is it a handle? Can I, don't I say know. that? I don't know. The thingy is at <laughs> Earlville Librarians. So if you put Earlville Librarians, we'll pop up. We're, we're, we're the only ones. So. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you're there. I did just get another phone call from Earlville, Iowa the other day. Again? Yeah. Wow. That's crazy. It's funny. I love it. It's funny. It's so fun. So fun. I had a whole conversation once with somebody three towns over, maybe four, and they were like, I'm trying to get to your library. And I'm mm -hmm. like, well, we're right across from the post office. Oh, and they're no. like, no, there's <laughs> something across from the post office. It's not the library. And I'm like, but yep, we right are. here. <laughs> but we're right here. I'm literally looking at the post office. She was. I see it. We had a whole conversation for nice. a whole minutes. different town. Yeah. Whole different nice. town. And then asked me, she's like, oh, you're in that town? Oh, you know, do you know these people? They're with my relatives. I'm like, yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good old time. Nice. These are the kind of phone calls we get. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was a fun, fun conversation a couple years back that I'll still remember forever. Nice. <laughs> but again, thank you so much, and we will see you in the next podcast. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. See you later, Ellie.